Hey YouTube, this is David from Well You Know We're Alive with David. And I've been watching people on Ustream and YouTube, and they seem to be having some problems with setting up the IRC clients for the Mac, such as XChat, Aqua, and Colloquy. Um, they're very simple to do. Um, they're not hard to do at all. I'll show you guys how to do it right now. For both of them, that's XChat and Colloquy, very simple and yes very simple like I just said anyway first I will start off with extract my f preferred sorry my preferred IRC client for the Mac and once you first open it up there won't be any text here most likely it's gonna be either a white background or black or whatever but this will pop up and it'll say extract server list and what you're gonna wanna do is you're going to hit the plus button don't worry about all these servers in here, They're just preloaded servers or whatever. And hit the plus button, and it should say new network. Now make sure it's highlighted and click edit. Now it'll say servers for new, and under the server just click once, and this should come up, and type in the server name that you're trying to connect to. So if you want to connect to say ustream.tv, it's chat1.ustream.tv very simple oops I, bit, I did chat2 two. chat2 two, I think would still work but chat1 is the most likely one and then if you wanted to do say wild ride it's irc.wildride.org and that's very simple too and if you want to put a port it's just 6667 I don't think you have to it's just there but I'm going to connect to a different server since I already have both of those open. I'm just going to connect to this server. And I like to uncheck global user information and put in my own information. So my nickname will be, uh, let's make it Johnny. For the hell of it. Username, David Maureen. Real name, David Maureen. And then right here, you could just leave that by itself, nothing to do. And I'm going to join channels help. And your channel always has this number sign in the front of it. Connect command, you don't have to put that, I like to put it, whatever. Mix server password, I do have a password but I'm not going to put it in there because it does not do the stars and star it out. As you can see, I could type anything I want in there and it doesn't blank it out or anything same as that but I'll just leave it like this and then click done now you can name your server just by clicking once over it as it's highlighted and I'll put test server click on it and I'm going to connect in a new tab since I do not have I have tabs open but normally you just hit connect and if you have tabs open already I suggest you open it in a new tab click OK and there you go. That's how you connect on Xtrat. Now let's say hi. Uh, hey guys, you are in a video. I wonder. I wonder if I still have power. No. Anyway, now on the colloquy. Very simple. Um. I'm going to just show you guys this. Now I'm not going to close it because I already have some things open in it, but once you open Colloquy for the first time or the second time or whatever, you probably notice and probably get really upset that of the fact that it, it doesn't show up. No box shows up. But what you have to do, it's very simple, you have to go up to File, New Connection. Now, then, you can just put in your connection. As you can see, I already have it in there. I'll just put in J Johnny1, and I'm going to use the same server. Same servers as last time, nothing different. It's IRC, Internet Relay Chat. Connect, and this should pop up. As you can see, I have this. I already have a couple of servers, but don't worry about that. I'm just going to click Join Rooms, and I'm going to do at, oops, sorry, help join 
and there you go. That's as simple as that. It's really simple. And there's everything. It's as simple as that, guys. It really couldn't get more simple. I know it gets a little frustrating, but what do you expect? It's software. Software has problems. But anyway, thank you guys for watching. Um, please check out my website, spotdex.com. Whenever you get a chance, live stream, live chat, etc. And I'm doing videos like this all the time whenever I get a chance. If you have any new topics for me, I'd really like that. I'm kind of out of topics to do videos on. But anyway, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time.